<laughs> We're here doing the Ward Acting Studio course, mm-hmm. six week intensive in New York. I know it's the last time. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little bit emotional. <laughs> how have you, um, have you found the six weeks? Oh, look, it's just gone so quickly, but it's been amazing. And it's the only course where I've just seen everybody make so much progress in such a short amount of time. And that's been really lovely too. A friend of mine, Jordy Walland, he was like, you have to go do this course. She's incredible. And I just took his advice and I paid my money and I did six weeks with Wendy. And I had only done tech one and I just went... I need to do tech too. I just followed her over to New York. I didn't think twice, just got on the plane and was like, yep, I'm coming, Wendy. (laughs) Yep. I wanted to experience a change of pace. It was nice doing it part-time, but let's get a bit more, let's raise the stakes. Yeah. Tut, 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 tut. Every day, all day, you're in it. Mm. And it's dedication, man. It's a dedication and it, it proves to yourself, do you really want this? People rave about Wendy and I looked her up and the course sounds amazing and after I finished doing King Kong I did the uh, like a part-time course for Tech One and I loved it and then as soon as she was like I'm going to New York I was like great I'm coming I'm coming to train too. She actually you know honestly really cares about you yeah it's it's not just a course where you you know she's getting money from it she really honestly wants you to succeed yep. yeah, and do your best. If I could say anything about any of the training I've had with Wendy, I've never had such a clear picture, absolute crystal clear snapshot of where I am now as an actor, what I've got in the bag and what needs to be built. So you've got three classes. You've got the technique, you said, the voice and the career. Um, How do you think all three are relevant to each other? Uh, they just all go hand in hand. I mean, you've got your career because if you don't have a good savvy strategy, then, you know, you can just, if you're not thinking like a professional and you're not putting the right uh, practice in place, then, you know, that's one bit that, you know, you're not going to be putting yourself out there. You're not going to be driving. Whereas if you don't have your tech classes, then you're not working your muscle. You're not actually working on your product, what you have to sell. The voice classes were just exceptional because... We went back to basics of where your voice comes from and where you should speak from. And it's true that, you know, sometimes when you're on stage all the time and you're projecting and you think, yeah, that's the voice I'm supposed to have, it's actually not. It's kind of a false voice and it's something that you can fall into bad habits. And I loved how Joanne really got us back to our core and our understanding of just simple breath and release and enjoyment of of your own sound i'm sitting there every single careers class with you know a board of people coming out with this that and i'm thinking why have i never heard of this why have i never had a class like this you know i think the teaching that you get or the what you learn is definitely invaluable definitely definitely worth the money and it's, it's not even just when you're doing the acting it's watching wendy work with other actors in the class and actually being able to see it and experience it in real life and understanding and I felt like every single class I was going oh my god it makes sense. So you've traveled all the way from uh, Australia to New York. Yeah. Full on. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. Um, uh, you know financially it's, it's, a, it's a big step but at the end of six weeks what do you what do you think about the money you've spent? <laughs> Worth it. And they're, and they're things that work, like these principles are a structure and a kind of a routine in the way you work, which you think, but aren't you supposed to be free and creative? Yeah, but what happens is that the, the structure, something so strong underneath you, gives you the, take, takes care of some stuff that you don't have to think about and gives you the freedom to be free. It's worth every cent and you're not going to get this kind of training back home. Um, you think you're going to get the training, but you don't. And Wendy is smack bang on telling you the truth, giving you what you need. And one thing she says, if you stuff up one day, make sure you just come back the next day because that's the best thing about falling down is you get back up and try and do it again. And it may not be perfect and, you know, that's just going to get in your way to try and be perfect. Stop performing and just do the skill is one thing that I remember Wendy was saying to me in class and I just absolutely switched on and then I forget it sometimes when I go back into another class and then she says something again that you link on to and all of a sudden you're doing some of your best work that you can do within six weeks. I look forward to coming back.
either in New York or Skype sessions or one-on-ones, phone calls, whatever I can, just to keep in touch. And especially with all the people that you meet, I think you've got yourself a new family, so it's fantastic. Thanks, Wendy.